Hi there, Matt Wade here, and today I thought I'd cover a cool new little feature that came out for Microsoft Teams and your status. So let's jump right in. So recently, Microsoft Teams rolled out this new ability to essentially set yourself as invisible or offline. In addition to that, coming soon or may have already rolled out to you, depending on uh, you know, your tenant or the system that you're using, is the ability to also set the duration of your status. So if we look at Microsoft Teams, then we go up and we click on uh, our face in the top right corner, you can always select the status here. You have available, busy, do not disturb, uh, be right back, appear away. But appear offline is the new one. This effectively is useful for, you don't want anybody to know that you're at work. Whether you need to have a few hours of really good focus time or you're on vacation and you came back into work or got back online to check some things and you don't want anybody to ping you while you're doing some things just to catch up or just to see how things are going without uh, being you know, pulled back into everything, you can set yourself as offline. So you can select that, you'll see you get a little X there. And then the new feature is this duration. So I can click on that and I can set my status as any of the options that are listed in there. So I can say up here offline, it can be for any of these options here. So let's say I wanna be uh, away or appear offline for two hours, I can do that. So now for the next two hours from when I click that, I will appear offline and then I'll go back to whatever state I was in prior to that. So if I'm at my computer, I would be um, here and available. I can also reset that status to go back to what I was before. So maybe I don't want that timer to continue going. So I'm just gonna click reset status and you'll see that I am back to being available, which is what I would expect. Now this is rolling out, the duration aspect is rolling out now as of the end of October, 2020. It should be rolled out by the middle of November, 2020. Uh, so if you don't have it yet, just be patient. It should be out there soon. If you're an administrator, that's trying to oversee, manage uh, this type of uh, feature. This is a bit ripe for abuse. People can easily set themselves as offline forever or whenever uh, to appear that they are not available or that they're not working or whatever, uh, so they're not being bothered or just don't wanna be taking part in the work that they're supposed to be doing. Uh, as far as I know, uh, there are no administrator options, tools, commandlets or anything like that to sort of manage this or, or govern it at this point, uh, but definitely keep your eyes out for something uh, for doing that in the future. That being said, the appear offline is a feature that people have been asking for for a long, long time. So it's really nice that we have that. And the duration is just a little bit of icing on the cake for your status. So you don't have to go in and manage it yourself. You can know that, uh, you know, I'm going to a doctor's appointment, so I'll be away for the next two hours. And by the time I return, it'll automatically set me up to be uh, whatever my, my default status should be. So I think that's a pretty cool new feature and hope you find some use out of it. If you enjoy tips and tricks like this for Microsoft Teams, Office 365, Microsoft 365, I have a new book coming out. Teach Yourself Visually Microsoft Teams is available for pre-order now. It will be your go-to field guide for everything you need from the user level of Microsoft Teams, very step-by-step, -step, screenshot heavy, ready to go, and just gonna be your little trusty companion when it comes to using Microsoft Teams. Thanks so much for watching. As always, a like and subscribe is much appreciated. If you have any comments or questions, please leave them in the comments below, including any requests for future topics or videos. And happy buying some freedom using the new status options within Microsoft Teams.